So we're gonna start in the Tunnel of Trees. It's one of the most iconic streets in all of Kauai, and it leads directly into Okaloa Town, where you can get amazing shave ice. I wouldn't share with anyone. Just keep one for yourself, enjoy it, and sit down, have a good snack. Next up, right around the corner, is Spouting Horn. It's a really fun low hole right on the ocean. The blow hole blows every couple minutes, and it's super fun to just sit and wait for it to spout. Whoa, that's a good one. You'll quickly notice the chickens and the roosters are all over the place. You'll see mamas with their little hatchlings all over, and it's super fun to kind of catch them around. Right next to Spouting Horn is a cute little souvenir shop that you can go and look for all your little trinkets and souvenirs to buy. My kids always love to look through them. Probably my number two thing that you have to eat when you're on Kauai is a puka dog. My favorite is to get the polo sausage with pineapple sauce. It is the most amazing hot dog you will ever eat. I promise you that yellow sauce right there, it is to die for. One of our favorite snorkel beaches to go to is over in Boipu, and my kids love to go and snorkel and boogie board and play in the water. It's really one of our favorite beaches. The snorkeling here is so easy to do. The water is very shallow, easy to stand up, look underwater. The fish are really colorful and fun to look at. And if you're lucky, you'll even see a turtle. This is the first time in my whole life that I've ever seen a sea turtle in the water with my snorkel gear on. I was shocked and so excited. And there he is, sunbathing for all of us to look at. As you head back over to Lahui, you're going to catch Wailua Falls. Super easy, right off the road. You don't even need to hike to it. Just hop out of your car and go look at it. It's super fun. After a long day, one of my favorite restaurants on the island is Kaoki's Paradise. We like to go there for a date night so we don't take our kids with us. It's kind of in a lush area. You can sit right on the outside of the building where you can see the trees. This is pineapple muffins, artichoke dip. They have amazing food and anything you get there is gonna be really good. I got steak, Jason got seafood. They really have a good menu to choose from. Next up is our second favorite beach and it's Lidgate Beach. It's really, really good for snorkeling. This day we went and was really windy, but at the same time, it still makes for great snorkeling. It's in a little protected cove so it's perfect for little kids to just walk out and play and you don't have to worry about them, but it's also perfect for snorkeling and seeing fish. If there is an unofficial rating system for shave ice on the island of Kauai, JoJo's would be number one. Look at those flavors. That berry berry is my all-time favorite. My kids like to get rainbow ones, but really any one you choose is super good. Working our way back over to the Kapa area, this is the Noka Fair, and it's one of our favorite souvenir areas, and they have done so many renovations to this area. It is super cute. All these little houses that are set up, with all the different shops inside them are super, super cute. If you want a really good place to go for souvenirs with your kids, this is a really fun place to go. Not only are there super fun things to look at and to buy, they're also adding some food vendors and some little areas where you can sit down, relax, and enjoy the scenery. Our favorite is to this little surf area where you can get photo walks. The drive up to the North Shore is super pretty and not one to miss. We love to stop at the Kilauea Lighthouse on the North Shore before we hit Princeville and Honolulu.
Thank you for watching, you guys. One thing that I missed on our trip this time was the Waimea Canyon. We just didn't make it up there, but it is the Grand Canyon of Hawaii. So if you want to go check that out, you are more than welcome to because it's really fun. Thank you for watching and aloha.